Not long before half-time in the first RB della Madonnina of this season, AC Milan's Souza received the ball on the edge of Inter Milan's penalty area, cut inside and curled a majestic left-footed shot beyond the despairing grasp of Samir Handanovic. Then, in the second half, five minutes after his opener had been cancelled out, the Spaniard restored his team's lead with a cool right-footed finish after a nimble no-you-see-it-now-you-didn't dribble that almost left Miranda, Inter's defensive rock, on his backside. That match finished 22, meaning Susu's goals were not rewarded with three points. Yet that smoky, enthralling San Siro night was arguably the pinnacle of the player's career thus far. His performance in such a pivotal, globally renowned fixture acted as a sort of conclusion he said goodbye to his underwhelming past and began a new trajectory, one that could still end with him living up to, perhaps even exceeding, his substantial early billing. A member of Spain's 2012 European Under-19 Championship winning squad, a squad that also included the likes of Paco Alcacer, Juan Bernat and Saul Niguez, Susu's formative years as a professional were punctuated by trials and tribulations. He found himself consistently tantalised on the fringes of Brendan Rodgers' Liverpool, loaned out to Almeria, and then sold to Milan. He left for Italy at 21 years of age for a 1.3 million euros fee, his status wavering ominously between prospect and squad filler. Initially, he found Serie A tough to crack. He found his progress blunted by the presence of another left-footed playmaker, Keisuke Honda, and after just one outing in the first half of the 201,516 campaign he left for Jenner on loan. But, just as his Milan career looked set to mirror his Liverpool one, he stepped up a level. Jenner at the time were coached by Gian Piero Gasparini, who has led Atalanta into the European qualification berths this term. Gasparini has a reputation for steering failing former starlets, a cast that includes Diego Perotti, Thomas Rincon, Iago Falk, Mbe Niang, in the right direction, and Suzo thrived similarly under his wing. His form at the Stadio Luigi Ferraris led to the suggestion of a future with Milan upon the end of his Genoa loan spell, a notion only furthered by the appointment of Vincenzo Montella as Milan coach. The importance of the manager's arrival was emphasized by Susu's agent Jesus Fernandez, who told Calcio Mercato that, we knew Montella played a similar style of football to the one in Spain, so that could get the best out of Susu's characteristics. The arrival of the new coach was decisive. Suso was given his chance in Montella's first game as Milan boss, a friendly against Bordeaux last July. He scored both goals in a 21 win, and with that a first team spot was his. Ever since, Liverpool's decision to sell has been made to look more ridiculous with each passing week. The 23-year-old has attracted glances of admiration from some of Europe's top clubs, and it's easy to see why. Without the ball, he doesn't stand out. He has a strange, shuffling running style, almost a waddle, that is more in keeping with a cumbersome centre-back than a lithe attacking midfielder. But when he has possession few are more pleasing on the eye. His dribbling is graceful, his balance constant. He controls the ball elegantly, instantly and decisively, and is able to craft ways out of the tightest of tight spots. And Susu's beauty comes handy and with an unquestionable effectiveness. He has been one of Syria's most productive attacking players this season. Scoring seven goals and setting up nine to have a direct hand in over 30% of Milan's league total. Only four players in Italy's top flight have more assists to their name of, or complete more dribbles per game. He doesn't shy away at crucial moments, either. Having had his mentality questioned in the past, Suzo has delivered an emphatic response in 201,617. As well as the aforementioned derby double, he scored a thunderbolt to lead an ultimately unsuccessful fight back away to Napoli in August. He set up Manuel Locatelli for the only goal in October's 10 win over Juventus and did the same for Giacomo Bonaventura against Italy's reigning champions in December's Italian Super Cup. He found an 85th minute equaliser through a mass of bodies against Lazio in February and he provided the cross for Alessio Romagnoli's goal in the most recent Milan derby. He may still return to the Premier League to haunt Liverpool. Chelsea and Tottenham have both been linked, and considering the two teams' styles of play and usage of inside forwards it is not at all difficult to envisage Suso hovering dangerously in the right half-space within either's 3,421 system. At Liverpool there was no going forward and I needed an opportunity, Suso told La Gazzetta dello Sport in December. He has found that opportunity in Milan. He created it. Share this 27,096 at Milan, Liverpool, Premier League, Serie A, Suzo.